sospechoso del nuevo coronavirus. El coronavirus COVID-19. El coronavirus también se expande por América Latina. The pandemic of COVID-19 was reported in Central America on March 6, 2020. The patient one of coronavirus in this region was identified in Costa Rica. A 49-year-old woman that landed via air to the country from the United States. To that date, the health system of Nicaragua was prepared for the arrival of the virus, trained the health personnel, made some informative press conferences every day, protocols of detection were established and rooms were set up for any attention to patients who have COVID-19 in 18 hospitals. The coronavirus came to this country on March 18, 2020. But what has happened with the contagion curve after 40 days of its arrival to Nicaragua? On March 26, Nicaragua presented the 0.16% of positive cases of COVID-19 in Central America. The case 1 of coronavirus was reported on March 18, a 40-year-old Nicaraguan citizen who came from Panama. After two days, there was another case. The second imported case would be a 47-year-old man with critical conditions of health. The curve kept the two cases during seven days, until March 27, when two new positive cases of COVID-19 were reported. New cases were informed the 31st of March, the 5th, the 9th, the 10th, the 11th, the 20th, the 23rd, and the 26th of April. A case per day, until reaching 13 positive cases. In 40 days, Nicaragua just presented imported and non-imported cases. To this time, there is no local transmission. Controlling the contagion focus in an efficient way has been one of the strengths for Nicaragua to control the curve. Hay un seguimiento permanente, de, igual de los casos que entran de, y se les encuentra que tienen. Eh, señales que podrían traer el virus, se les aísla, se les atiende y ya cuando pasaron el periodo de aislamiento, bueno, salió bien, ya sale pa, para su casa. The report of people who died by COVID-19 mounted a figure of three deaths in 40 days, patients with complications due to their prior illnesses. And despite the medical efforts on March 26, the first victim died and it was the only death in March. The curve of the deaths increased in two more victims the following month, between the 18th and the 23rd of April 2020. Ellos me están informando que él ya estaba, a ver, se le había bajado la presión, ya había sido la segunda vez. En eso también, en, al bajarse la presión, creo que complicó un poco el respirador, el respirador que él tenía y comenzó también problemas en el, en el riñón y posteriormente tuvo un paro. Nicaragua does not have a collapse in its hospitals, neither of funerals. The authorities have informed that the pandemic has a very low advance and that keeps the country in phase one. La pandemia ha avanzado lentamente. No es que no haya entrado en Nicaragua, claro que entró, pero su avance ha sido lento. Regarding the number of recovered patients, the first good news was gotten on March 31st, after doctors dismissed the patient number one of COVID-19. In total, seven out of 13 positive reported cases have recovered. To this date, the curve of the positive cases have been kept under control. Nicaragua and Belize have the lower figures of coronavirus in Central America. Both countries have demonstrated an effective handling of the pandemic.